Here we have a number of uh, vials as it is being used in pharmacies across North America. Now, this is how the consumer receives their medication, their pills, from their favorite pharmacist. And this is what they do. They open the cap, invert in their hand, and usually uh, there is more than what they need that comes to the palm of their hands. Right away you can see there are too many pills in the palm of the hands. I have been quite uh, synchronized in the motoring of this action, therefore I have only a few. Uh, but most often it does happen that there is quite a number of pills that is totally unnecessary present themselves in the palm of the hands. Now, again, if the palm is sweaty or soggy or you're in the middle of doing something, all these pills are now contaminated. You put them back, you actually cause the rest. And sometimes when you put them back, you, everything goes back. Now you've got to do the action again to get your medication that you're supposed to be taking. So, however, uh, this by itself, as you can see right here, uh, pills falling on the floor and endangering the life of the children. Of course, right now it's on the table, which is very safe, and we'll take care of it and make sure that nobody gets their hands on it. However, in real life, often they fall on the carpet, on the hardwood, and they get lost, and of course, it's consumed, unfortunately, by the children of minor age. The consumer will not invert it while the lid is open, and they will invert it when the lid is closed. So, it really eliminates any chance for the pills falling on the floor or any excess handling on the pills. Uh, hygiene is, um, is considered and so you bring it back to the upper position then and then you open the cap. You will see that the pills are conveniently located at a close proximity of your fingertips and you will pick them as you need them. This can be used in any size container, one size fits all. This big boy here, <laughs> I'm sure none of us want to stick our fingers in there. We've got to bring a fork or something to get this one out. So all we have to do is invert it while the lid is closed, especially when they're not filled up and there's only a few left. Bring it back to the upright position and again, you will have the pills at the close proximity of your fingertips and you take them as you need them. You want more, then you take more. We don't know what the doctor has ordered. So, there are a number of pills available for you. So, really what it does, it turns any container into a full container. Because if the container is full, like let's say this one, we really don't invert them, do we? We just pick them as we need them. But as soon as it is used and goes down in numbers, like this one, we really can't pick them by opening the cap without inverting them into our hands. And most often, uh, no container is really f given to the consumer filled up. <laughs> As you know, most prescriptions are really lasting one, two, three, or four weeks, and if they're more than half, usually they're filled in another container for many different reasons that the pharmacists see fit. So right now we have this uh, particular device fitting into any container of any size and, and any particular shape. You have your pills here again, pre-filled containers of vitamin, or conventional containers of prescription medicine. Any size will be taken care of by our device. One size fits all, and simply and conveniently. We call our little device dolphin because it always fetches what we want it to fetch from down deep in the containers. So let the dolphin catch your pill.